Okay, welcome to another episode of GeekOutdoors.com. Just got some stuff in the mail, and it looks like these might be the final pieces to my Monster Linux PC build. First and foremost, I got the box. Not sure what's in there yet. About to find out. And also, I got a little bag right here. So let's go ahead and get right into it. I just was really excited that I got these. So I'm just go ahead and open this up. First and foremost, got some memory. Yes, 16 gigs. I'm so happy it's not 8 gigs. It's DDR4. On top of it, I can overclock this. And it is also compatible with the new Skylake processors. Yes. This is going to go really well with my AMD RX 470 GPU and the gaming motherboard. And most people would say 8 gigs is enough, more than enough for a lot of people out there, even for gaming. So 16 gigs is really going to help me a lot when I'm doing a lot of video editing and so forth. And uh, that's it for that. Let's go ahead and move on to the box itself. Okay, so let's see what we got in here. Take the trusty opening knife or go this way. And as soon as I got them in, I was just so excited. I just wanted to go ahead and open them right away. Because I really do think that these might be it. I could actually build my PC now. Okay. Let's see what we got in here. Oh, man. It's just never going to end with all this stuff. It's so awesome. Okay, what do we got here? Fans. Lots of fans. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, I got one, two, three. Three, four. Okay, let me take this out of the box. Looks like I got six fans. Let me take this out of the box. Okay, so what do I have? I got seven. Count them, seven fans. Man. Oh, so I wasn't sure what was in the box. I thought it might be the CPU, um, but we're almost there. Almost there. So I'll, well, Okay, so I got more than enough fans to keep my machine cool um, along with my uh, RAM right here. Yes. Okay, so the party is not quite over yet. Got something else. And maybe a few more things after that. Let's go ahead and get this open. Much simpler for these bag packages. Let's see what we got in here. Or, well, let me just cut it right here. Okay, what do we have? Oh man. Another SSD? Okay. Look at this. So, my brother got me a 750 gig SSD. That's ridiculous. Um, because the initial plan was to have the 250 gig SSD and then a mechanical hard drive. But now, I have two SSD, um, and this is gonna be an extremely, extremely fast machine. So not only is my operating system gonna be fast, but also my storage is gonna be fast as well. This is shaping up to be one speed demon of a Linux PC. Okay, we got one last mystery box. And it's right here. What could it be? I wonder. So let's go ahead and open this final mystery box up. Hopefully it is something good. And I'm guessing it will be. Uh-oh, I could already tell. This is going to be pretty insane. Oh, that is what I'm talking about. This is the final piece. This is what we've been waiting for. The brains, the power of the whole system is the Intel 
core i7 6700K unlocked CPU Skylake processor. It's gonna be a beast. Um, and you know, like the reason why uh, my brother got this, um, and he, he could have easily got me an i5, which would have been just simply amazing, just the i5 alone. But the reason why I got the i7 is because I'm going to be doing a lot of video editing, uh, using it as a workstation. And the main difference between the i7 and the i5 is primarily the fact that this actually will uh, support better multi-threading. Okay, that's for sure. So if you are doing really CPU intensive tasks, then the i7 is going to be better than the i5. And uh, yes, it can definitely play Crisis. Okay, so after today's final shipment, it looks like I've got all the pieces that I need to finally build this Monterey Linux PC. So let's go ahead and recap everything that we have. First and foremost, got an HP 23 inch IPS display. Got seven different fans, 120 millimeter cooling fans. Got the EVGA 550 watt power supply. Also got the 16 gig to DDR4 uh, memory. Got two different SSDs, one for 750 gigs, the other one's for 250 gigs. Got the extremely powerful Intel uh, Core i7-6700K processor. Got the MSI Tomahawk motherboard, Z170A. And also got the MSI AMD Radeon RX 470 GPU. Got the CryoRig H7 uh, CPU cooling fan. And finally, got the NWIN 303 mid-tower case. So the very next step is we're going to actually finally build this Monster Linux PC. And I really want to thank my brother for getting all of this together. And I'm really excited to finally get this built. So um, if you have not seen it, I do have a playlist for all of these different build parts. You could check it out in the description below. And also, I've been actually chronicling my whole Linux PC build journey on my website. It's also in the description below as well. Now, as always, if you really enjoyed these videos and you got value out of it, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and we'll see you on the final Monster Linux PC build. Thanks for checking out this episode. And as always, if you like these videos, be sure to click on the subscribe button. And for full written content, audio content, and additional geek stuff, head over to geekoutdoors.com and I'll see you outdoors on the very next episode.